A jubilant crowd watches on as Spain's women's national team lifts the World Cup following victory against Serena Wiegmann's Lionesses, a groundbreaking achievement for Spanish women's football. But the moment, which was marred by a kiss during celebrations from FA chief Luis Rubiales on player Jenny Hermoso, has now led to an official sexual assault complaint against the Spanish official. Until now, Jenny Hermoso, who claims that the kiss was non-consensual, has kept a rather low profile following the final. The official complaint from Hermoso means that state prosecutors will be expected to ask a Spanish court to place the 46-year-old under investigation in the following days. A judge in Madrid would be tasked with conducting a probe and deciding whether Rubiales would face charges before inviting prosecutors to indict the suspended Spanish FA president. The footballer has said the kiss left her feeling vulnerable, describing it as an impulsive, sexist act, out of place and without any type of consent on my part. Rubiales retaliated in a statement last week and said, the spontaneity and happiness of this historic moment led us to carry out a mutual and consensual act, a product of great enthusiasm. As Rubiales continues to face mass calls to resign, the national team manager Jorge Vilda was fired with no official explanation. Vilda has responded to his termination in a statement reading, I have a clear conscience because I've given 100% effort every day during these 17 years but I don't understand the decision and I don't think I deserve to be fired. He added that the news was given to him in a meeting with Pedro Roca and the Vice President of Equality, and they cited structural changes within the organization. Vilda has been replaced by his former assistant, Monse Tome, making her the first woman to hold the position. Since the official complaint was lodged by Hermoso, Rubiales has yet to respond.